students today we are going to do some activities from this unit activity 1 here are some words they denote different kinds of wind look up a dictionary and find out the different shades of meanings of the words given below storm breeze tempest hurricane four words are given to you you please find out the meanings of these words first you have identified the different types of wind using the four words given above prepare a crossword puzzle ഇവിടെ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് ഫില്ല് ചെയ്യാനായിട്ട് ഒരു പസ്സിൽ തന്നിട്ടുണ്ട് ഈ പലതരത്തിലുള്ള നാല് തരത്തിലുള്ള വിൻഡ് ആണ് ഇവിടെ ആൻസർ ആയിട്ട് വരുന്നത് എക്രോസ് ഫസ്റ്റ് വണ്ണ് നയൻ ലെറ്റേഴ്സ് ഉള്ള ഒരു വേഡാണ് നിങ്ങൾ എഴുതേണ്ടത് ഇൻ അവർ എക്സാമ്പിൾ The nine letter word is hurricane. So, you should write the meaning of the word hurricane. Hurricane means storm with violent wind. Storm with violent wind. So, you please fill it in the place of number 1. Number 1 answer is storm with violent wind. You fill in the puzzle hurricane. Number 2. There are 7 letters. A 7 letter word is needed to fill the puzzle the seven letter word in your example is tempest the meaning of the word tempest is violent storm with heavy rain so you please fill number two violent storm with heavy rain tempest Then down. Number three. There are six letters in this word. The six letter word in our example is breeze. Six letter word is breeze. What you mean by breeze? The meaning of breeze is gentle wind so you please write down gentle wind then number four there are five letters the five letter word in our example is storm Storm means violent disturbance of the atmosphere with strong wind, rain, thunder and lightning. Violent disturbance of the atmosphere with strong wind, rain, thunder and lightning. So you please write down this in place of four so dear students you please write hurricane number one hurricane number two tempest number three breeze number four storm activity two read the passage given below it was the season of rain 
Lily and Baby were on their way to school. It may rain soon, Lily said. Baby looked up. The sky was filled with clouds. A strong wind blew. It began to rain. Water mixed with mud was flowing through the road. Note the underlined phrases in the passage. The phrase, the season of rain can be replaced as rainy season. Now rewrite the two other underlined phrases as shown above. Here is a passage in this some words are underlined. First, season of rain. It was the season of rain. A season of rain another pagaram namka rainy season in the ubiokya. Season of rain pagaram rainy season in the edda. Adapole sky was filled with clouds. Sky was filled with clouds. Adhine pagaram edauna or phrase and the body can question. The sky was filled with clouds. Cloudy sky. Cloudy sky. A strong wind blew. It began to rain. Water mixed with mud was flowing through the road. Water mixed with mud. Muddy water. Water mixed with mud. Phrase in a pagaram, amkubiyoka on a phrase on a muddy water. So please write cloudy sky and muddy water. Number one, cloudy sky. Number two, muddy water. Activity three. I have a talking parrot, Gina said. Binu and Mubina went to Gina's house. They saw a parrot. It could speak. It is an English parrot, Gina said. Make it speak, Mubina said. What is your color? Gina asked her parrot. I am green, the parrot replied. Oh, it is really an English parrot. Binu and Mubina sat together. They went near the parrot and stretched their hands to touch it. Listen friends, be careful. If you don't ask questions, it will get angry and peck you. Binu and Mubina were worried. They did not know how to ask questions. I can help you. See what I ask, Gina said. Gina, where is your mother? Parrot, my mother is in London. Gina, Mubina, now it is your turn. Who are you? Mubina asked in a low voice. The parrot was happy. It replied, I am a parrot. Oh, that's good. Come on, Binu. Now you try. Can you help Binu frame some questions? Make use of the tips given in the table. Here is a table. The table contains three columns. Ask about your questions. Parrot's answer. First and third. Third column is given to you. First column, name. You ask about the name of the parrot. Parrot's answer is, I am Titi. Now, question is, what is your name? Then place, ask about 
the place of the parrot. Where are you? I am in a cage. Where are you? I am in a cage. I am in a cage. Then, ask about action. Action or na enda ana chayi nadu. Parrot noda ni enda ana chayi nadu. Enda chodi kena. Parrot in the answer, I am talking. Yan, some sari ki ana na ana parrot to parai nadu. So, namula enga ne chodi kena nadu. What are you doing? Ni enda ana chayi nadu. Then, reason. Parrot in the answer, I am sad because I have no friends. 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 Why are you sad? Why are you sad? You ask about time. Enana, Porana, Nokavaranadana, time. Answer, it is, it's in October. Adana, answer Paranadu. When the question, when is your birthday? Enana, Ninde, birthday. Then ask about the mood of the parrot. Answer, I am not fine. How are you? How are you? I am not fine. Please, dear students, please ask to the parrot, What is your name? Where are you? What are you doing? Why are you sad? When is your birthday? How are you? You can also role play this activity in the classroom. Write the questions and answers on placards and distribute them among your friends. Those who got the placards with the questions would form one group and the rest would form another. Now fill the gaps in the placards using suitable questions, words or answers. Now let the groups stand face to face. The members from the question group can come forward and ask the questions one by one. The members from the answer group can come forward with apt answers. Here is an example for model questions and answers. Question placards. Here answer is given for you. Because today is my birthday. Answer. Today is my birthday. Why are you happy? Why are you happy? Because today is my birthday. Then second one, dash class are you studying? Dash class, which class are you studying? In which class are you studying in? Eighth class lana I am studying in standard five. I am studying in standard five. Dash, do you go to school? Dash, dash, how do you go to school? I go to school by bus. Dash, are you today? Dash, are you today? Answer, I am fine, thank you. How are you today? Answer, I am fine, thank you. 
Dash friends do you have? Dash friends do you have? Answer on the video. I, how many friends do you have? How many friends do you have? Then get the friends in the other parent friends side. I have 10 friends. I have more than 10. In the wedding, you get the friends in the other. I have 5 friends, I have 10 friends, or I have more than 10 friends, etc. Then, dash are your hobbies. What are your hobbies? In the Kyanan hobbies. What are your hobbies? In the Kyanan hobbies, my hobbies are collection of coins. Reading, dancing, etc. Dash, will you go to school? Dash, when will you go to school? A poor Ningal school il When will you go to school? At 9 o'clock in the morning. I am school at 9 o'clock in the morning. When will you go to school? When? Dash is your favorite subject. Dash is your Which is your favorite subject? Ningustomula subject. Nyanda Ningustomula subject. Which? Answer My favorite subject is mathematics. My favorite subject is history, etc. You can write likewise. Dash is your favorite actor. Dash. Favorite actor. Dash is your favorite actor. Who is your favorite actor? Are you an actor? Naldan. Dash is my favorite actor. Are you Mohanlal is my favorite actor. Mamuti is my favorite actor. Or Vijay is my favorite actor you write likewise then dash old are you how old are you i am 10 years old i am 10 years old dear students please try to write this in your notebook okay thank you